I'm Jacqueline Wiley and I was born and grew up in the country, in County Tyrone, Northern Ireland. As a child I played outside, climbing trees, damming streams, looking for wild strawberries and mushrooms. I inherited a love of the countryside from my parents. My dad goes fishing for trout and salmon and my mum loves gardening and history. So many of my early holidays were spent wandering around Ireland looking at lovely scenery, historic houses and gardens, and searching in bogs for archaeological monuments. I have continued this fascination with history and landscape. For 10 years, I worked as an archaeologist, specializing in recording and conserving old buildings. I now work as an artist, and I'm interested in how value is assigned to materials and processes. I like to use cheap, easily available materials and I'm fascinated by the way that art is valued differently from craft, often along gendered lines. And I produce large, abstract, knitted paintings that draw attention to this divide. More recently, I have been exploring the potential of new technology to make art. For Manchester Timepiece in June 2011, I helped turn Manchester into a giant sundial. With two other Manchester artists, I spent the longest day of the year mapping the shadow cast by the Beetham Tower and posting these locations every hour on Facebook and Twitter where it went viral. Since 2005, I've had an allotment in Charlton. It's my little piece of heaven and I always feel relaxed once I get through the gate. I really enjoy eating my own fruit and veg, especially my spuds. Everything tastes so good when it's fresh. There are no pesticides and zero food miles. I get up close to a tremendous range of wildlife. Everything from birds and insects to frogs and the occasional hedgehog or squirrel. I get regular exercise throughout the year as even in the winter there's lots to do. I feel part of a friendly, supportive community and I am very proud of the fact that I served on the committee and helped to set up a communal plot that got more people off the waiting list. I'm about to return to Northern Ireland to begin a PhD study of how artists can use social media to make and promote their work. I'll miss my allotment but it'll be great to revisit the landscapes of my childhood and perhaps climb a few trees again.